Good morning. This is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. Okay, there's a lot of requests for us to create a step-by-step -step guide on how to pair your smartwatch, okay, with a DAFIT support app, okay. So, we already created an article for this. Just check on the links below if you want to read the article so this time we're going to show you a video tutorial on how to connect your smartwatch to the DAFIT app okay DAFIT support app this time our test device is the Umidi G smartwatch so we have here the Umidi G smartwatch okay so we're going to try it out and connect with our smartphone okay so we have our smartphone here our user manual and our smartwatch so let's start okay on your user manual look for the QR code of the application okay try to scan it okay in our case so we have here the QR code directly okay use a QR code scanner or you can just search it in the Google Play Store or iOS Store okay the App Store okay so let's try and start let's check so we already scanned it but we still haven't installed it so let's try if it's still here Okay, so we have here after scanning the app we are pointed though it opened on the Google Play in the DAFIT page so we have here the app okay so about this app use DAFIT band to set track and follow your heart data day and night okay use DAFIT band to set track monitor and track your sleep quality so here oh, we have over 1 million downloads so it is just less than 10 megabytes offered by Crepa so release on December 2017 and we have here set of permissions okay so contact locations SMS if you are not comfortable with the permissions here if want to if the app is asking to activate you to activate the sets of permissions here if you are not comfortable you can deny it okay but to test it out we will turn it on most of the permissions here okay let's see if there's a conflict or not okay so we have a lot of reviews here negative and positive reviews so let's try to install it and connect our smartwatch to the support app okay so let's try okay so here you can set the permissions here so contacts location sms photos and media phone camera microphone okay so let's accept tap accept and we are downloading the app let's wait it's just less than 10 mb so i guess it will not take a while to download this one see as you can see it's already installing a very light app for your smartwatch again if you have any questions regarding this app please drop a comment below and we will answer your queries okay if you have a if you already installed the app and you are having having a problem on connecting pairing or synchronizing your smartwatch to the support app please check out the links below we have a link for tutorial especially on how to fix okay troubleshooting the DAFIT support app so let's try to open it so we have here it will ask for your profile okay we'll just leave it here so here's the UI of the DAFIT support app. Okay. 
so we have here you have not link a device your profile here and the main page so tap to add the bracelet or the smartwatch just tap to add okay let's wait again so it will search for the bracelet here okay so we have here the U watch 2 from Yumi DG okay is it the smartwatch or not so we have here the code let's check if we can find it here set oh we don't have the details here So if you can find the code for your device here, so I guess it's the U Watch 2. No. Let's try. So there's no code here. Okay. So let's just tap on the smartwatch. Usually there's a code for this one. Okay. Other smartwatches, if you go the if you go to the settings and go to the about page or about menu, you can see the code. Okay, in our case, it doesn't exist, but it has the name is already here. So, I guess the, there's no worry that you'll be connecting to a different device. So let's check. Oh, as you can see here, it is connected. Okay, so that's it very easy to connect your humidity humidity watch or any other smart watch with the support app dafit okay again let's try to remove and install it again make it sure that you activated the bluetooth connection here let's check if it's if the location is not activated let's try okay so location service is disabled okay so in to be able to connect to your smartwatch okay with the deficit support app you have to enable the gps so let's enable it turn it on okay so that's it so it it located the u watch 2 again tap on the bracelet Okay, if it's not, not connected, tap it on again and set your connected. Okay, so that's it. So the, here are the features. You have at least three watch faces here. More watch faces download. So I guess the DAFIT do have a lot of watch faces to download here for your smartwatch. Just tap on download, downloading the watch face resource file. Where is downloading app so far installing and connecting it to your smartwatch is very easy okay we did not encounter any issues at all okay if you're wondering why do you have to activate the gps i guess it's for the location services here so every other smartwatch that I've encountered, it's also always asking you to activate activate the built-in GPS of your smartwatch. Okay, notifications here. So it supports phone messages, Facebook, Twitter. Here are the social apps: WhatsApp, Skype, Instagram, Line, KakaoTalk, and other applications. So if you want to receive real-time notifications here. Just enable the push notification access here. Okay. What else do we have here? Alarms. So you can set set at least three alarms here. You can set the goal settings for the steps. And we have here the step tracking sleep tracking the heart rate 
outdoor running look more training data here okay so this is the ui of the dafit support app okay Again, if you have any questions regarding the smartwatch, please, and the Dafit support app, please drop a comment below, and we will answer your queries. Okay, so we have here continuous heart rate detection, dynamic reminders to move. We also have here the quick view and the weather. Okay, so that's it. If you want to remove the app, just tap on remove. Okay, if you want to add it again, just tap on the add. It will search for the device and tap on the smartwatch and that's it. It's connected. Very easy. Flawlessly connected without any issues at all. As long as you have the exact or the compatible version, the operating system of your smartphone, as well as the version of the Dafit support app. Okay, if it did not work, you have if you are experiencing experiencing any issues at all, maybe you can download the lower version of your the Dafit support app. Again, this is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news and reviews. Goodbye.